Duke Connors starts a tailback. Parrish with the touch pass. Turns it upfield. And in rushing yards, both of these offenses, high tempo and balanced. Corral to the slant. That's complete broken tackle. Braylon Sanders. Face to the field and taking advantage of it with the slant. To the ground again. And now they flip. Corral pulls it back. Deep shot. Plenty of air underneath it. But he over for six yards. Swing pass. Sanders in motion. They need six to keep the drive alive. Corral will scramble a great runner. And he runner this year. Eight touchdowns on the ground and willing to put his shoulder down like he did just there. Here's Jix. He's taken a few this year. Hands it off. Ely again. Holding on the 78. Second and 16. Corral pulls it on the run. That little pump fake got him more to go. Swing pass. They need eight and him. Matchup. That's where I'd go if I was Corral. Matched up with Alante Taylor. Looking for him. Ran an in route. Corral will take off with his feet. Another flag. Corral rumbles. He's best Holy corner. Bridge down here at the bottom. Alante Taylor working one on one with Braylon Sanders, but it's also the pocket. Watch how the pocket opens up when there's lanes and coverage. Parrish can't find Rolf. Well, Tennessee rolls everybody down into the box. No look. No safeties, cover zero look by Tennessee. Corral trying to take advantage. Call off the hand. Braylon. Three-man rush. Corral looking. End zone, another flag, and it skips in. Before the pass, holding number one defense. Phillies half the distance to the goal, and it goes an automatic first down. Corral. Trying to direct traffic. We'll go for the pylon. He is. Corral gave it to Cobb. And asked, could he then start the website, checkerneeland.com? Spencer said, have it. They got this thing cranked up for now a really cool tradition. And the D-line for Tennessee has been playing really well. Clock at five. Pressure, he'll sprint again, he's got a lead blocker. Corral scrambles and gobbles. Play call, Tennessee sat back in zone coverage, and this is a design quarterback draw. Top zone coverage and dialed up the perfect play. Handoff, Jerry and Edu in space with the football. Superb athlete in both football and baseball. Ely another opportunity here. Ole Miss moving again. Pressure from the edge. They pick it up. Corral goes deep. Open. In. And this ball was on the money. Matt Corral does a great job of looking right first to move the safety. And that's why there's nobody over the top of Pearson. This is Henry Parrish with a stiff arm. From. Touch pass. John Rice Plumley. Ball came out, Corral's forward progress, it stopped, they didn't whistle it dead, it's picked and scooped, and Tennessee may have been gifted. Well, yeah, Corral, I don't think, I think Corral thought the play was blown dead. You look at his body language. I don't think there's any doubt. He's just holding the ball. There he is. Ball start, number 64, offense. The goal, still first down. Out of the end zone. Into the wide. He's got two outside the numbers on either side. Pressure. Corral flips it. He was the girls. Intentional grounding. Yeah. Number two. Offense on this drive. 
Corral with a swing pass. This was good for them early. It's Jerry and they want without the tight end depth. Who they typically are is one of the nation's best scoring offense. Third and three. Trying to find the edge is Parrish. He's got a first down. Braylon Sanders, senior from Hogansville, Georgia. Ely will circle around Corral. Wanting to go deep. Beautiful pattern, and it's complete to Pearson. And Tennessee bling, brings blitz off the right side here. It's picked up well, and Pearson has an opening in that soft zone. As I mentioned, Tennessee playing safeties over the top so far against Ole Miss. Here's Snoop Connor. Got touched at the line. Scratching at the surface of his role in this offense. Corral wants to go deep. Down the sideline, and another over. Broker again had to check with Corral. Here's that draw again. And Corral picks up a first down, will lower his shoulder into in. Clock at two. Snoop Connor got a block on the edge from Plumley. Great job up front by Tennessee. Nothing there for Snoop Connor. Able to turn some. Corral shot into cover. They'll get it to him out of the backfield, and he overthrew it. Correct. Put on a line right here. Bring Pearson across the line of scrimmage, trying to get it up and over a Tennessee defender there. Looking at school history, Chad Kelly. Corral wanted to go deep sidearms this one. Rebels fourth in the country in points per game. Corral hands it off. And down tonight. Corral keeps it. Quarterback Corral's already dirtied his jersey tonight. Couple of grass stains. Pulls it back. Will run for another first down. Ended up picking up the first down. He's wanting to throw. Deep drop. Ball was tipped and after <laughs> throwing down windmills on the basketball court. They had been 200 since fourth grade. Corral finds a gap. Ely with the block. And Matt Corral running the footballs. These aren't designed quarterback runs. You know, Tennessee's playing great coverage on the back end, and Corral's just having to make quick decisions to pick up yards with his feet. Here's Jerry and Ely. They're going to split Drummond out all the way a foot away from the sideline, bottom of the screen. Pump, go, shot to the end zone, caught, touch. Knows I got to pump hard to get Elante Taylor to bite and then throw a dime over the top. What I love, though, is he separates his hand when he pumps. That's what the cornerback. <laughs> <laughs> By the way, the next Manning cast coming up a week from tomorrow, the Seahawks. I got a suitcase full of quarter zips and khakis, and we did stay at the graduate. Uh, that should count for something. Ole Miss trying to find some room. Corral, pressure, and they got him from behind. Ball came for the sack. Third sack of the night for the Volunteers. Corral trying to scramble for another one. Extra man coming. Corral flushed. Pump fake and a scramble. And he tight ropes up the... They'll roll the pocket. He finds a tight end. Kelly. That's scored in the second half. Corral pulls it back. Fires to the seam, complete. This is Dontario Drummond. He's got an Ole Miss first down, and he's got the sideline. Dontario Drummond takes it hard line. Great job by Corral here. Watch this. He wants to throw in that first window. Tennessee defender right there, so he pulls it down. Still able to get Drummond the ball quickly. And that's all Drummond after that. And now Corral off of Drummond's hand. Shot on the wheel route, incomplete. Going right back to Snoop Connor. He is. Connor tripped up. Connor again. Shoves his way to the goal line. He is in. And then Matt Corral wants to hit this first window to Drummond. Look at this. He's got to pull it down and throw that second window ball, which is dangerous as a quarterback because then you get into safety's backside. Luckily, a quick release, accurate throw by.
see if the Rebels have one more in them before the half. Kelly got redirected. Corral on the run. Finds him anyway. Well, completely derailed. And somehow getting back on track. Good jump off. Corral taken down after a low snap. Pressure. Corral escapes it. And it's a turn in to another. Watch 51. Orlando Umana getting out. I told you guys earlier in the game, you get in space like that, body and a defender up, sometimes can be very difficult. Oh. Pressure up the middle coming. Corral pulled it back. Back foot finds the sideline. Third time they've ran that. Oh, well, they got time. it. It's worth it. Sorry, they got it for intentional grounding. You don't usually see that a ball thrown that far. In that direction, that's the top of your screen here. Let's see. Got five that's working over there. Right you here, got a guy right here. I mean, back ball. They try to run. Darren Ely stood up. But yeah, Matt Crowell's definitely on the smaller side of quarterbacks. Third down nine. Plumley on the wheel route. It is broken. Up. Biggest BC Boys concert I've ever been to. First and ten. Corral. On the run, delivery. Boy, Corral just about two feet behind Drummond here. I mean, yeah, that's juice on the ball. Crowd certainly into it. Corral puts that one on the numbers, and it's carried by Casey Kelly for an Ole Miss first. So fast once he makes the decision. Great off-platform thrower, and this one stays true, and it's a big one earlier in the game that would have been a touchdown on a post route. This time, a wheel route, one he should come down with. On second and ten, back to the ground. And generate velocity without your base. Pressure coming. Five-man rush. They beat it with a toss to Dennis Jackson. And he's got a rebel. They need a few of these guys to step up on the outside. A little slide of hand. He's hurt this Tennessee defense. Zone coverage using his legs. Corral with the pump fake to gain a little bit more. Parrish. Pardon me, Connor. Corral missing a lot of weapons. Nothing doing here. I've got to stay on that Corral. One blitzes. Corral goes by him. The other one blocked, and Corral will run for a first down and plenty more. Matt Corral. Excuse me, you bring one, and 38 here is actually going to come and then stop. He's spying Matt Corral there. Up a little special. Corral gets touched in the backfield, couple of pumps, and he gets head coach here in 2009. Ole Miss trying blitz from the edge. Corral sees it, can't do anything about it. Easily come off the edge here on a blitz. Corral actually wants to run this up to the left, but Beasley forces him. See that? Corral On the money with the completion to the edge and a nice little view. Also slightly behind you and put it right out in front so we can run and catch. And now Snoop Connor around the corner. And up the Holding oh, number zero offense. Ten yard penalty from the spot of the foul. Three play second down. Missing his two top receivers in his starting tight end. Here's Snoop Connor taken down. The analytics say about momentum. Because Tennessee's got it. Corral. Gonna scramble. Got some room and gotta hurry. Corral. Nobody open. They're all deep. Now he checks down to Ely. And he gets wrapped in there. Really tight coverage all night. Here's Corral straight ahead. Everybody full. Ah, he's got a blocker out there. A three-yard run. And right guard 55 here. Ben Brown does a good job of just getting a piece of Aaron Beasley as he shot through that gap to allow. Ely in the backfield. Corral keeps it. Plus, what a performance by the Ole Miss quarterback. End zone. Caught. It has on the linebacker. Watch his eyes as he stares at Matt Corral, right? He knows that route's coming, but allowing him to find those rush lanes. 
Corral hands it off, and Henry Perry, a true freshman last year, was kind of the third wheel to Connor and Ely this year, getting a lot of opportunities. He gets just down for what? Corral, design, run, first down, and a hit and a lick. Boy, just 200 pounds. He is willing to put his shoulder down. <laughs> and Corral is just so tough. Corral looks left, looks right, will run right. We asked him about running and taking. Corral hands it off when Matt Corral is playing. You Fake the toss, Corral, look in, can't afford to take a sack, fires, intercepted! Yeah, Roman Harrison really makes this play, you're going to see him redirect and force Corral further outside the pocket, and this is, don't make it, we thought. Matt Corral to throw on first down, and it was fought, and it looks like it should be easy, it's not. Parrish, first down Ole Miss. Physical game continues. Little toss to Pearson. He almost looks surprised and he cuts it. Corral will try to run it. Got some blocking out there and he dives. Right, this is that quarterback draw. They must be averaging 10, 15 yards almost a, every time they run this. Corral trying to make some history tonight. Before the game starts, Tom. Nobody needs to see that. Second, <laughs> second and eight. Corral with a left hand gets rid of it. Again, out of the backfield, Snoop Connor stays on his feet. Talking on the outside by John Rice Plumley. Dennis Jackson there. Connor and Parrish have been real weapons for Corral out of the backfield with so many receivers injured. Corral backpedaling now. Blitz from the edge. Corral stands tall. Now trying to escape and he gets dragged. Grass in front of him. Be a quick, easy throw. Pearson clears. Pressure coming. Batted ball. That is behind the line and it is not. Here's Matt Corral finally back to action at tennis. Tennessee was selling out for the run here. Man coverage on the outside. Everybody else. All the fans coming down to the first row in the student section. Play gets off. Corral hands it off. And Connor stop. Kiff and I roll the dice. I throw it. Corral has it. Lost his footing. Corral's legs because he's been money all night. But Byron.